Hi guys. Well, I'm hoping this video finds people that like to actually build things. And what I'm trying to do is inspire others to build a lens free or a lens inverted or a lens altered transformer. So in other words, something that does not have the typical drag of lenses law. And the way we do that, I believe, is to somehow use a permanent magnet along the lines of an electromagnet in a transformer somewhere and by doing that I think we can harness the energy of a permanent magnet I don't believe a straight coil on coil transformer is going to be over unity however since some machines are running over unity powered by magnets and they are real and they do exist well then it would stand to reason that if you add a permanent magnet into a transformer system you should be able to extract the energy from the permanent magnet now my idea which came to me the other day is to use a permanent magnet to actually direct the secondary flux away to prevent lenses law now I'd like you to try to use your imagination and find out different ways to do that this is just a basic experiment to show that you can actually shunt a magnetic field to control it and guide it even a very large magnet here can be shut off completely by applying a magnetic field over here okay so what we're doing is we're actually controlling the magnetic flux and guiding it the way we want if we can do that then we can probably create free energy by controlling induction and controlling the lines of force and the lines of flux in the direction in the path that we want thereby negating lenses law so I'll take this socket here and I'll show you a quick experiment. Stick this here. Okay, so that is stuck there because of this magnet. This iron here contains no magnetism. So I'll show you what we're going to do here. When you create a north field here, it is attracted to the south field. This lines up the iron and it tightens up the magnetic field thereby releasing the socket which cannot stick to the transformer core anymore okay so if you were to put a coil on the outside of here you take the south field and you remove the south field by directing it this way okay so when you remove a south field what you're gonna get is a north field the opposite that's how lenses law works you remove south you create north and vice versa okay so now that we have a north where do you think the north flux lines will go they're not going to go towards here because we have this giant magnet here attracting the lines of flux so what it's going to do is instead of having lenses law lenses law is going to drag the flux over here away from the production coil or the primary coil the supply coil okay so this is an example of creating electricity with induction without Lenz's Law, without the typical Lenz's Law. Lenz's Law is still here, it's not gone. But you see, Lenz's force is going this way, away from the primary coil, thereby negating the effect of Lenz's Law, and violating the law of conservation of energy and all that jazz. The stuff they say you can't do, right? But hey, I believe it can be done. And I'm just trying to inspire others. So this is my experiment. It's very crude. But this is all I've got so far. So here we go. Hook up power. Okay. So as soon as electric current flows through here, it releases the magnetic field. It actually straightens the magnetic field, preventing it from escaping and reaching the socket. So we'll try that again. Try to actually hit the wire. Okay, so that's all there is to it. Now use your imagination. Put your generator coil here. Build this on a different scale. Build it appropriately. Use a high winding coil to switch a very large field do it with one polarity not AC but just DC and switch it 
You generate power without Lenz's Law. Okay? So I hope that gives you some ideas, and it may or may not be useful. But uh, like I said, that's all I have for now. Thanks a lot, guys.